Hey everyone, I'm Forest, and patch 14.23 is bringing us the final round of buffs and nerfs for season 14, and I'm here to break it all down for you. Before we dive in, I want to invite you to join our growing Discord community. We are building a space for league players to learn, connect, and improve, whether you're grinding rank or just looking for a cheer group to play with. I'm also offering free coaching to everyone who joins before Christmas. Next week, I'm releasing a tier list summing up the best junglers for the end of the year. So stay tuned for that. Now let's dive into the Boss and Nurse Riot has lined up for us. Starting with Master Yi, his Q critical strike bonus is increased from 35% to 56.25% while the on hit beard remains the most popular choice for Yi mains. This buff gives a great alternative and it will be interesting to see if Yi mains are swapping to crit beards from now on. The potential for higher burst damage in teamfights and duels could make pretty a more viable option, but it will depend on how players adapt. Next we have Rumble, who is seeing some love for his AP scaling. His Q's total AP ratio is increasing by 10% from 100 to 110% and his W's AP ratio is going up by 5 from 25% to 30%. While these buffs are more targeted at top lane Rumble, jungle mains can and should try this pick in the upcoming patch. Either way, these are all solid improvements that gives Rumble a bit more power when it counts. And it is starting off the nurse with her base had her dropping from 650 to 620. This makes her a little squishier early on, so Alice Pains will need to be more cautious during invades and early skirmishes. Her potential for dominance in the right hands remains, but it's clear Red wants to tone her down slightly. Grace, one of the strongest junglers in the current meta, is also getting a nerf. His second Q bonus hit ratio is being reduced from 40 to 160% to 40 to 140% which amounts to about a 50 damage drop at full build with max Q. While this will slightly lower his spell damage, it's not the reason Grace is so oppressive right now. His great focus meta build, fast clear and exceptional scaling keep him dominant, especially with AP junglers like Elise and Talia being nerfed out of competition. If you are entering Grace, don't worry, this small adjustment doesn't change his core strengths. Dr. Mundo, despite primarily being a top laner, has been strong in the jungle due to his clear speed and durability. Right is tweaking his E bonus AD from max health, reducing it from 2 to 3% to 2.2.8%. While this might seem like a nerf, it's unlikely to impact his jungle performance in any noticeable way. Mundo's power remains intact, but Riot may revisit him in the future patches if he continues to overperform. Adjustments for Talon and Warwick Talon, a flexible pick for both mid and jungle, sees a couple of nerfs. His base magic resist drops from 39 to 36, and his passive monster modifier decreases from 120% to 110%. These changes aim to bring him in line without gutting his potential. While he will be slightly less effective at clearing jungle camps, his core strength in mobility and burst remains untouched. For Warwick, Riot is making small changes that balance out as buffs overall. His base AD drops from 65 to 63, but his Q cast range is increased from 350 to 365, and his W passive attack speed duration goes up from 1 second to 2.5 seconds. This means Warwick can now stick to his targets better and trade more effectively. If you have Bellow Diamond, Warwick remains a strong and consistent pick that rewards good decision making. Finally, we have Poppy, who is getting some adjustments that affect her jungle and scaling potential. Her base armor is being reduced from 38 to 35 but her armor growth per level is increasing. Meanwhile, her Q's base damage is shifting from 40 to 120 to 30 to 130, and its bonus AD ratio is increasing from 90% to 100%. These changes balance her early and late game power, keeping her a solid tank option in both the jungle and top lane. That wraps up the buffs and nerfs for patch 14.24. This patch has a little bit of everything, from encouraging new builds like Critmaster Yi, plus some nerfs to the most dominant picks like Grace and Elise. If you are looking to stay ahead of the meta, now is the perfect time to join my Discord server. We are creating a friendly and competitive community where you can learn, share ideas, and find teammates. Don't forget free coaching until Christmas for all Discord members who are subscribed to my YouTube channel. Let's keep improving together as we head into the new year.